Okay, take two. Bam. Hi everyone, welcome back to Liz Beauty XO. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to do something a little bit different because I haven't, obviously I haven't done this before. Um, I want to do like a favorites month, but except this is going to be a favorites year. You know, the year is almost over, so why not just do a favorites year? So what I want to talk about is all my favorite products for the whole year that I've been used up and pretty much I need to re up on, okay? So um, let's see, let's get into this, shall we? My go-to like night foundation, pretty much something that I want to do like a full coverage is the Estee Lauder Double Wear. This foundation is just pretty much like, ugh. Like it sets, I'm really like, I have oily skin, especially my T-zone area. So this, um, this does the trick pretty much. My second favorite foundation that's more like, um, casual wear, not more so night look in my opinion. Some people, you know, wear every day, night, daytime you can, but I love this more of like a, just a casual wear, daytime, nothing too heavy with the Makeup Forever HD. I do say that this shade that I have, which is, the shade is 177. It's a little bit darker compared to my Estee Lauder um, shade. So I kind of want to get another one just a little bit lighter because sometimes like in the summer I get darker, which is perfect. Like I was saying, um, like in the summertime I get darker. So this shade is pretty much perfect. But when I'm, when it's winter, it gets cold, like, you know, uh, us, you know, dark girls, it gets a little bit lighter. So Estee Lauder is like the perfect foundation for me. Next favorite mineralized skin finish. Well, I would say my next favorite bronze mineralized MAC skin finish powder. It's natural. So obviously you can tell I've hit pan. Um, I'm going to get my money's worth. <laughs> so I'm pretty much just I need to get another one but I really want to try different products but then again I want to go back to this because I just love it so much so I need to get a new one as you can see I love it okay um another powder that I do love that's another um, setting powder besides the Mac Mac is more like a natural finish everyday wear I don't want to put foundation I will just wear this as of right now I don't have any foundation because I need to go to the airport so I don't want to do too much on my face but when I want to bake and set especially after heavy duty Estee Lauder I'll use um, Laura Mercier <laughs> um, translucent powder so it's a, it's a loose powder um, but this sets really well it's not they have like a highlight but I don't need much of a highlight if I'm going to use a lighter concealer underneath but um I use this and this is like bomb.com girl you need this in your life <laughs> um okay my next favorite is the ColourPop I love ColourPop it's cheap it's affordable you know can't go wrong with it especially when you're broke because I'm broke here okay um <laughs> I use a pencil I, I'm using like a mixture of the black and brown because my hair, I dyed it back to black. But um, yeah, so I use a mixture of this just to match um, the color. But um, I also add on black and brown. Um, you can't go wrong. They're $5. Yeah, you can't go wrong with that. Like, that's why I use so much. So $5. Let me get another one. Let me get another one. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, so my next favorite palettes, makeup palettes. I have two of them because like I've been doing a lot of traveling this year so these are like my two favorite um, go-to especially Carly Bible because it already has the highlighters in there so it's just like you know I don't need to bring all my highlighters it's just this one does the job the Nubian um, palette this is like another favorite as well especially as dark you know dark complexion women that has all the colors that you you need like come on now like you need chocolate this color especially like crease colors and this is just bomb like this is like an everyday palette like i will use this every day like so my next favorite is a blush like oh, this blush man 
Like, I'm just getting the chills right now just talking about it because it's just so, like, bomb. <laughs> like, I love this blush, if you can see. Can you see? Or can you see that? Okay, so this is Carl 08's Coralina Baked Powder Blush from, um, I think this is, what is this from? Oh, duh, Milani. <laughs> um, but yeah, from Milani, from the drugstore. So this is like my go-to. Although this is like fall season, like I would still pull this out. Like this one right here, it just does a trick. It just looks so flawless and natural. Like um, perfume favorites. Now, I've always been the type. I used to work at Airy. Airy is part of American Eagle, so um, their perfumes like it's it's like really nice especially even when i go to american eagle it's nice as well so i've always like been the type to be like oh no i need to stick with airy perfumes because no one else can have any nice perfumes that smell as nice as airy which i was wrong <laughs> but anyways but i always get like um airy perfume so as you can see i'm all i'm almost all but yeah i'm not gonna butcher the name but it smells <sighs> delightful I love the smell and like I would wish I wish that would they would come back with um like their collections they used to have a whole bunch of perfumes with the names of the bra like I think it was Abigail like it was so cute and they have like the little ones as well it's so cute I wish they would just come back and bring them back but I don't know hey but this is the bomb.com and then my next favorite is Zara I love shopping at Zara Zara is like my thing like that is my store you know but um mm, this one the purple bottle bomb I know Nicole Guerrero had like talked about this I was just like yes girl I got it too it's so long mm -hmm. the Twilight Mauve oh like although it wears off a little bit but it's good to spray it on spray it on again <laughs> but it's really good like when I got this I think it was only one left and I was just like I had to have it <laughs> okay oh you know what I forgot one more thing one more makeup which is a highlighter highlighter by Mac and this one is called oh darling like this one like you just can't go wrong like I know it's kind of similar to um, some of the highlighters in Carly Bible palettes as well but this packaging amazing highlighter bomb like <laughs> you can't go wrong with this like this one is my favorite so I forgot to include that one too but anyway so here's my last favorite favorite like let me tell you let me tell you before I even show you let me tell you what I did to get this shit boots right here like let me tell you when I saw them for the first time I was like oh no I need this in my life. Like she made a high waist, um, a thigh high boots before and I was just like, oh, this would look so cute if it was just short, like just regular booties. And then you know what? She just made them. So I was just like, ah, I had to have them. I had to have them. Like I saved up my money. I was on time. I was prepped and ready. The first but um, I felt like it was worth every penny. I love them. So let me show you. These are the booties. Love, like, uh, uh. I just love like I love I love I die <laughs> but yeah these are the booties right here they zip up in the back as you can see um yeah these are these are really cute like these are really cute I mean I don't know I don't want to like wear them every day obviously you can wear them. <laughs> I don't even have a job to wear heels every day <laughs> but um yeah these are like dope like she made a burgundy one as well which you know burgundy is cute but I see that's more if you were like a burgundy lover kind of thing but this black black goes with anything so I was like yes I had to have that give it to me but this is my favorite for this year um thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time Bye. I can feel it. I feel it.